Hi friends, welcome back. My hands are all sticky because I had syrup on my key and I thought I washed it all off and I didn't. Ugh. There is so much pollen on my car. Like I don't, I didn't even realize we were still in pollen season. Anyways, so today we are gonna get Halloween costume stuff. Uh, I'm going to probably do a DIY for the pregnancy one because I have to put it together. Follow me on Instagram at simplysam.13 uh, for the final result, which I'll wear on Saturday, probably, if he doesn't come in time. All right, guys, let's go to Goodwill. Okay, so I didn't film much out into the world because I was just taking it easy. And I've learned that walking around while pregnant and not having your husband to do a lot of things for you is pretty exhausting. So I'll just show you what I got. I'm pretty excited about it. Okay, I'm gonna start off with what I already have. So my friend Vicky got me this maybe three years ago now. Um, it's a little light and it's a rainbow. I'm hoping it fits me still. It will fit under the belly, I'm sure. Um, but this is going to be a part of my outfit and I already owned it, so that was nice. So then the top part of my outfit, I got this from Walmart in the plus size section, so I know it will fit well, is going to be a nice pinkish colored shirt. I got this sweater at Value Village. I'm assuming it's gonna be chilly. Um, so that sweater will go there. I still haven't told you what I'm gonna be. I'm kind of keeping it a little bit of a secret, showing you all of my components, and then I'll tell you. So then I got some opaque tights from Spirit. Hopefully they fit. I don't know if these ones are gonna fit, but I got some uh, booty shorts. Totally appropriate for a pregnant lady to wear booty shorts, huh? Um, <laughs> if not, I'm pretty sure I have gold leggings I can put on, but that for underneath the tutu. And then I got these at Walmart. I'm not gonna wear the zombie pin because I don't need it, but these for my hands for a little pop of color. These socks from Spirit for a little pop of color. So I did get Vampire Bud from Value Village, but I'm not sure how well that would work. And this was $2 or $1.99 at Value Village. And this liquid blood was $2. Oh, it says $6. <gasps> did they jit me? Cause they, oh, that makes me mad. Well, it was in the $2 bin. It makes more sense that it's $6, but they had it labeled $2. Those jerks. Well, I have a giant thing of blood, so if you need blood, it says creates real looking wounds, so hopefully that will work. Yes, yeah, so you're, you're, you're seeing a theme of pretty colorful and then blood. Whatever could this be? I did get this pink wig at Walmart for $6. I got this for $6 at Value Village. I was gonna put it somewhere else on my body, but then I found this at Target for $7. And it comes with some makeup and a softer horn and smaller. So what I'm gonna be is a unicorn with a baby unicorn spurting out of my belly. So I figured the smaller one would make more sense because it's a smaller thing and it will probably hurt me less and other people less if it's around my belly. And then just got some makeup from Target that I can use along with the makeup I already got from Walmart. So that's my costume this year. Now I'm going to start piecing things together 
making it bloody and gory and I'm so excited. Let's make a costume. I'm just gonna fit this on and measure where the horn will be coming out of. This will definitely not fit around my belly, I don't think. Holy hell. So I think that I'm gonna cut this and make it a little longer, which will be nice. But I think right there's about good. That'll be good, and then we'll do some rips and tears in it. Looks like a fun little belly button. Reality, where his head is, would be down here. It'd be like a penis. Demonetize. Good thing I'm not monetized yet. So we got my nail clippers that we're gonna use for our scissors. Okay. Good morning, my people. Um, so, yes, it's in the crib, but it's on blankets. It's fine. So, we're going to test this blood. It's been all night. Uh, let's see if it's dried any. Mm, still damp. I am going to have to take the hair dryer to it. Man, I really hope it dries. I think it's finally drying. Yeah, there's barely any blood getting on my hands. Oh, there's still blood getting on my hands. When I finally decided to blow dry that, it was about five o'clock almost 24 hours later it still hadn't dried fully but it seems like it's gotten pretty dry it still had a little bit of remnants but whatever it should be dry by tomorrow and if not i'll just blow dry it a little bit longer yeah you're not gonna get the grand reveal today because i'm gonna wear it tomorrow be sure to add me on all the social medias they'll be on the end of the video snapchat instagram and twitter and then you can see the grand finale tomorrow, Saturday, the 26th. As long as Mr. Dude doesn't come, because I've been feeling a little, he hasn't dropped, so. I hope he doesn't come out tomorrow because I want to wear my costume, dang it. So anyhow, thank you so much for watching. This has been Sam, and I'm simply doing the things that I need to do, want to do, or things that I think will be fun and bringing you along with me. Oh, you guys, biggest, excitingest thing. We are over a hundred subscribers. Thank you so much for all your love and support. I cannot express to you my excitement. There's a lot going on now, but we will do something special and celebratory of a hundred subscribers. We're at 105 right now. I've been making a whole bunch of new friends. So thank you so much. All right, you guys. Thanks, bye.